Namaskar Mudra Namaskar Mudra, the greeting gesture, is a palms together position as in the gesture of prayer. Take up an erect sitting position such as the Vajrasana and place your hands palms down on your thighs. Gently bring both your hands up to your chest and join your palms together. Keep your thumbs close to your chest while your little fingers are pointing outwards. Keep your elbows in a lifted position and don't let them drop into a lazy slouch. The inner meaning of this mudra is I salute the Divine Self that is manifesting through you. This mudra is commonly used in many Eastern cultures as a gesture of greeting and peace. It is a gesture of energy conservation because energy that is normally lost from the palms is conserved by close circuiting the nerve circuits of both palms together. This mudra is used in many asanas and kriyas of Hatha Yoga to conserve the energy while performing the postures. At the spiritual level, it also helps us to recognize that the Divine manifests in all living beings. Slowly release the Namaskar mudra and bring your hands back to your thighs. This gesture of consciousness helps us to go within and attain to a state of elevated consciousness. From a straight back sitting position such as the Vajrasana, bring both hands up to your chest level with the palms facing forward. Join the tips of your thumbs and index fingers to form a perfect circle. Keep the other three fingers straight with the sides joined together in parallel. Place the chin mudra on your thighs with the palm facing down. This stimulates the femoral area that is located on the inner side of your thighs. Chin mudra helps to force the inhaled air to move primarily in the lower sections of our lungs in Adam Pranayama. Close your eyes and perform a few rounds of deep breathing into the low areas of your lungs. Union of the thumb and index finger symbolizes the union of the Jivatma the individual entity with the Paramatma, the universal entity. The three other fingers are held straight and together to symbolize Pratyahara, the yogic control of the senses. Chinmaya Mudra From a straight back sitting position such as Vajrasana, bring both your hands up to your chest level with the palms facing forward. Join the tips of your thumbs and index fingers in a perfect circle as if performing the Chin Mudra. Curl 
the other fingers inward as if making a fist. Place the Chinmaya Mudra on your lap to stimulate the femoral area located on the inner side of your thighs. Close your eyes and breathe deeply as this mudra helps to gesture pranic energies into the middle region of our lungs in Madhyam Pranayama. This helps to energize the entire chest region with healing prana that can be useful in healing various heart and lung conditions. Adi Mudra Sit in Vajrasana and bring both your hands up to your chest level with your palms facing forward. Bend your thumbs into your palm and then close the other fingers into a fist over your thumbs. Place the mudra on the inner side of the thighs with the knuckles facing outward. Close your eyes and take a couple of deep breaths as this mudra helps us to breathe deeply into the upper section of our lungs. Adi Mudra helps to send healing pranic energies into the head, neck and upper part of our body when performing Adhyam Pranayama. This is very beneficial for those suffering from disorders of this vital region. Brahma Mudra or Mahat Yoga Mudra. From a straight back sitting position, lift your hands and make your hands into a fist as in Adi Mudra. Place the Mudra in front of your navel with both your fists touching at the knuckles. The fist should face up while the outer aspects of the fingers face down. This mudra helps facilitate the neuromuscular system and stimulates the respiratory system to function in a proper manner. Close your eyes and perform a couple of rounds of deep breathing utilizing all parts of your lungs in a holistic manner. This mudra helps to correct numerous breathing difficulties that are the bane of the modern world. <laughs> 